Hello, it's Randy from Pico Technology. Today I want to talk about filtering techniques. This particular waveform we have is a 2019 Pacifica with a 3.6. I have all, all four channels in use. And for this, um, for this case here, I want to go ahead and remove or just hide my B, C, and D channel. I just want to focus in on channel A, which is our crank sensor. I can go ahead and close that. And I'll go ahead and close my channel labels. Now, uh, for filtering here, I want to bring in first off a measurement, in this case here, a rising edge count. And I'm going to go ahead and select between the rulers and then bring my rulers in. I'm going to place them approximately 360 degrees apart. And then we're going to get a count here of 58. I'm going to go ahead and lock my rulers and so that I can move these um, in tandem. And we'll notice something that might strike you as being odd, which is the point of this case is that um, it's the same 360 degrees on that crank, of course, and it should be the same each time that rotates by. And in this particular case here, it looks like it is not. And really this case is a it's gonna require some filter. This is a filtering issue, not an issue with the vehicle. So let's go ahead and bring in and turn on our DSP, go to channel A, hit our DSP, turn our, make our DSP active. And in this case here, I can increase or decrease um, this particular low pass filter. Uh, I'm going to just clean it up here a little bit. Uh, put it maybe at, um, maybe we'll put it right about 10K or so. Now, in order to refresh this number, this calculation here, you do have to move the rulers again. So I'm going to move the rulers again and bring it back down and kind of snap them back into place. And now we went from back to 58, which we already kind of knew was going to be should have been the correct answer. So that really is really a filtering technique in order to understand that when we take measurements and we apply measurements, that filtering may be needed in order to get an accurate picture of what we're doing that for. So anyways, I hope this helps. Thanks for joining me.